had she ate me. her scariest of all I think and this chick over here is like oh that's ha 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 what's going on my name is johnny and welcome back to horror reaction today we got crypt tv extended universe why was a teenage sheep they say there's no proof let's just do it got no snacks today to gonna cut back on the weight you know get my body right you know for summer okay mm -hmm. this is like nine the minutes following are entities from a diary recovered from cindy a teenager who okay. went missing shortly after a series of murders it is unknown what role she played in the incident. Man, but she's slim thick in the have back. Have revealed huh? a look into the mind of a troubled youth. Names and locations have been changed to protect the survivors out of respect okay. for the dead. The event remains unchanged. September eighth. I wish I was invisible. I, I guess you could okay. say I've been having trouble adjusting to my new school. Already on my first day, one of the mean girls singled me out. Looks you like we've got some the fresh meat, she said, after knocking my books on the floor. Her name is Katie, and you know? I have a feeling she's going to be on my case all year. I swear that girl is a psychopath. Like, you already have it all, Katie, so why are you bullying me? <sighs> right. Mom screamed when she saw my sweater had been ruined. I wish I could tell my mom about Katie, but she's never been the supportive type. Understand. The strong are going to prey on the weak, and you, my dear, are weak. She's just wow. mad she raised a loser. Wow. She wishes Katie was her What's little it? girl. Yeah, okay. A freak like me. September 14th. A cheerleader introduced herself to me today. She's so pretty, but there's something about her that I, I just can't put my finger on. She looks she like she's about to. From the other girls in school. Uh -huh. Right. The cheerleader told me that she's seen how Katie and her friends have been treating me, and she's willing to offer a way to help. Do you want to be a sheep or do you want to be a wolf? What is that supposed, is that to, supposed mean? to mean? September nineteenth. Oh my god. I, I I don't really have words to describe the kind of insanity I witnessed today. I was cutting through the alley behind the movie theater on my way home when I heard the voice of Lisa Brown coming around <coughs> the corner. Uh-huh. I panicked because I remembered that she and Katie were telling people that they were going to beat me up if they saw me out of school, so I ducked behind some trash cans and just prayed she wouldn't see me. Well, Lisa saw me hiding and then cornered me. I was positive I was going to get whooped, but then the strangest thing occurred. The cheerleader girl appeared and walked over to us. She was wearing a necklace with a little vial on it. Blood. At the time, I thought it was just decorative, but I think it had some kind of drug in it. What? She pulled the cork, and then, well, that's when things went insane. Okay. The whole thing feels like a dream. I felt a rage overcome me, a primal instinct of sorts, and it was intoxicating. You should do a werewolf. I couldn't help but give into it. I felt myself begin to transform into. What is going else. on? It is so weird to write this. I had become more beast than human. What? And for the first time, I felt like the best version of myself. What? And here's the scary part. Okay. When I came to, I was standing over the corpse. Okay, why can Brown. Her body had. She ate her. her. Scariest of all, I. Th and this chick over here is like, it oh, that's, me. ha, ha, ha. Am I going to jail? Oh, my God. September 20th. The next day. Okay. Everyone at school is talking Yo, look at that chick. She's slick I'm afraid to go to the police. Put some more clothes on, though. Jeez. I'm afraid of what the chick Look how point her feet are. She invited me to Katie's house on Friday. What's up, this little, like, this little hook right there? If the crazy cheerleader doesn't kill me at the party, then Katie definitely will. Um, hey. mom's yelling at me from downstairs. Uh huh. I don't know why she's mad this time, but honestly, I don't care. All I can think about is what happened the other day in the alley. Next September day. September 21st. Hmm. Mom hit me and sent me to my room without dinner tonight. What? You can eat? After what is she this? After told me to go to my room, I heard someone knocking at the front door. 
imagine my surprise when I went downstairs and saw the cheerleader standing there talking to my mom about us going to Katie's party together. My mom yelled at me and told me to go back to my room, and that's when the cheerleader pulled out her necklace again. I remember more than before. It didn't feel like a dream this time. The cheerleader did something with her necklace that caused me to transform. My bones began cracking, my body began contorting, and I changed into something. Something beast. My mom was screaming, but the sound of her voice was making me Oh my god! It was like all the rage and frustration I've ever felt. Dude, I'm, I'm in this. Like, I ain't even doing any more commentary. I'm just in it. new body, I was able to chase her down easily. I pinned her to the floor and sunk my teeth into her and... She tasted so good. What? I passed a mirror. Yeah, and that chick's still there. I was too scared to look at myself. Look at yourself. I caught a glimpse of what I looked like. My arms. My legs. Harry. <laughs> replaced with hooves. You're a werewolf, my guy. My a girl. Horns. Horns. Black after Wait, a werewolf have horns? When I changed back into myself again, she was there. The cheerleader was smiling. She was there, dude. My mom's corpse was barely recognizable. The stem of her martini glass was shoved through her skull. Her eyes gouged out. Oh my god. Her arms broken. That's your mom, dude. I began to panic. Yeah. I couldn't breathe. Of course. You just ate your I mom. I had killed the woman who birthed me. Yep. Who had fed me. The woman who Typical would Sunday. judge me. Who would always call me weak and yell and hit at me and... and yeah, so you, have, you have so much anger in you. She was gone. Calm yourself before you turn back into another I, one. I don't want to admit it, but I felt guilt for suddenly feeling so free. And I want to feel like that again. Okay. The cheerleader said, Katie's party is tonight. Want to be my plus one? AKA I turn into a werewolf and kill everybody there. One, I said to the cheerleader. She September 27th. He said so. So much blood. So wipe much your mouth. Death. Wipe your mouth it down. Also okay, wipe your mouth down. The power hasn't gone away yet. Not entirely. Ugh. I still feel it flowing inside me. Yeah. I went to the party. It's all bloody. I didn't even think. Oh, I think she's the one that's died. That died. Yep. Mm -hmm. Katie's face when I walked in. You should have seen it. Katie and her friends were getting ready to pounce on me when the cheerleader approached. She pulled out Oof. her necklace, and the transformation took place. She it just killed everybody. Smoother. Maybe because I didn't fight it. Everyone Yo, she's a that cheerleader jerk is a they jerk. Ran like scared little sheep, <coughs> and I hunted them all. Oof. I remember it all so vividly. Ugh. They shrieked, they bawled, they begged for mercy, and I slaughtered them anyway. The best was Katie. I oh, had she's... saved her for last. She locked herself uh... in the bathroom, but that wasn't going to stop me. Yo! I can still picture the look of terror. Look, looks like Shaggy right there. It's not it's Shaggy. <laughs> sight. I can still hear her screams. How divine they sounded. I can taste her flesh. Uh. Her blood. And I wish I could savor it forever. That's disgusting. I'm not gonna lie to you. No matter. There will be others. The cheerleader. Has assured me of such. Okay. I am a wolf now. And there are so, so many sheep. Oh my, um, she's gonna kill I everybody in our town or something. To hunt again. That cannot be the end. That cannot be the end. Are you serious? This is gonna be the last one. This one's called Canvas Found Furnishings. In about three minutes. We can get into trash bag side of the road. That's it. It sets the mood, you know. That's the mood. Phase that fuzzy car coming from the background, and it gets into the shot. Okay. All right. Like it so far. 
Let me get some water. You gonna pick something up? What's in the bag? Okay. Probably something weird in the bag, isn't there? Oh, she took the painting. That's a weird painting. I wouldn't grab that. It looks like there's blood on it. Yeah, it's some, something's gonna happen now. I don't know. It's moving. What? Step out of it, you weirdo. Okay. Is the painting gone? Or is it a different place? What? Oh, it's crooked. Okay. I'm. First of all, I'm. Never, I'm, ne I'm never pay. I'm never. That scared me. I'm never getting one of those ever. And the painting just cut her. You heard that? What? Like hypnotizing her or something. Is she gonna go inside the painting? No way. Honey, I'm home. Oh, it's dad. Gotcha. It's your birthday. Oh, she gave her him the freaking painting. That cannot be it. You just they bring you in and they just they just end it. Okay, Crypt TV, we gotta have start, have start having good endings. Okay, this is getting ridiculous. All right, everybody, this was the Crypt TV reactions. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you guys do the YouTube thing, like, comment, subscribe, and share with your friends. Always, guys. My name is Johnny, and I'll see you guys in the next video.